Mary Watts was the wife of G.F. Watts and while she was here in Compton she created several things including the pottery but also this magnificent building, the chapel and the exterior of it was built between 1895 and 1898 and this marvellous decoration that you see inside was completed in 1904 just in time for Watts to have his funeral service. This building just in the small village in Compton in Surrey is one of the great stars of the arts and crafts movement and of Art Nouveau design. What's astonishing about the building is actually the level of detail. Um, every surface is covered with decoration and colour, which was most amazing. And the other amazing thing about it is the fact that this was often made by very different people, all brought together for this. So for example, here, you can see these flowers above the rail, all created by the, the children from the village of Compton. And here also we can see what Mary used. This was on chicken wire. There we have string and felt, um, all dipped in sort of plaster and then painted over the surface. Something that actually sounds slightly Heath Robinson, but has actually worked remarkably well and has lasted so well over 100 years. And what Mary did was this, create this great vault of heaven. It's very Byzantine in what she intended to do, and sort of meeting of heaven and earth in this circular chapel. Are the angels of darkness and light? For all the, the area is actually covered with angels, right at the top, the angels closest to God in the center. And you also see this wonderful tree of life, which is a great binding image so from its roots at the bottom as it leads up and intertwines with everything uh, there but this was all part of Mary's um, great scheme where sort of content and meaning sort of about death and resurrection and its celebratory place that she's created um, here is held together with these decorations which you can see in it the wonderful Art Nouveau influence the influence of Celtic revival you know it's a wonderful eclectic mix and um, and still is one of the most amazing buildings just to walk into.